One thing we're frequently asked is if you can bury your drip tape. The answer is yes. In fact, there's even some compelling reasons to do so. Now, burying it does slightly increase the risk of clogging, even under the very best of circumstances. The best of circumstances in this case is to be sure to get drip tape with the outlet flap. The outlet flap opens during the irrigation cycle so that water can get out. When the water pressure stops and the irrigation cycle ceases, the outlet flap will go down. This will help prevent dirt from getting back in through the emitters or getting back siphoned. Now, depending on the size of your irrigation system, you may need an air vent if you've got your system buried. An air vent will allow air to escape the system on startup, and allow it to enter on system end. And this might help prevent any of the emitters back suctioning debris and potentially causing issues in your drip tape lines. Here are some reasons why farmers and gardeners love burying drip tape. One of the reasons to do so is it keeps it out of direct sunlight, which with even the best of UV treated plastics is gonna reduce its lifespan a little bit. But it also keeps it cool so that the water inside doesn't get real hot and potentially cause damage to your plant. A couple other advantages to burying it is it protects it completely from the elements, not just UV exposure, but think of hail damage. We've seen whole lines of drip tape, whole systems almost shredded by hail. Burying your drip tape also maximizes its efficiency. Drip irrigation is already one of the most efficient ways to irrigate, barely experiencing evaporation, but this eliminates even that little bit. And on a large commercial system, this can add up to a significant amount of water. In a lot of cases, particularly if paid labor is used, it can increase the risk of damage to the tape as well. It's because people can't see it and they might hit it with equipment tools or just careless foot traffic. Burying the drip tape can make some things easier. For example, think of area clearance landscape maintenance equipment like a lawnmower or a weed eater that can be adjusted to be a bit up off the ground. Well, if your drip tape is also buried in addition to that, there's virtually no chance it's going to be damaged by that equipment. So to answer the question, can you bury your drip tape? The answer is yes, you absolutely can, particularly if you want to. In many cases, it is advised to do so, though we do recommend using a type of drip tape that has the protected outlet flap in that case, and potentially installing an air vent or vacuum relief as well. Keep in mind, if you don't want to bury your drip tape, you don't have to bury your drip tape. It also works just fine on top of the soil. If you have any specific questions about drip tape, please don't hesitate to reach out in the comments below. We'll be more than happy to help. You can also find us at our website, dripdepot.com. And if you'd like to learn about using drip tape to irrigate plants in more detail, Check out our Growing with Trip Tape playlist right here.